Today's Weekend Download, a new media campaign comparing sugary drinks to cigarettes. Health officials in New York City releasing a new PSA. Take a look. Which one of these is okay to give my kids? This one has a warning from the Surgeon General. This one has over 15 teaspoons of sugar and can lead to tooth loss, increased risk of heart disease, and conditions that can lead to cancer. Okay, now joining us to talk about the concerns is ABC's chief medical correspondent, Dr. Jen Ashton. You also happen to have a degree in yep. nutrition, so you know all about this kind of mm -hmm. stuff. Is this overhyped or is it this real? I think it's real, and I think we will start to see it in other states all over the country. If you talk about the two and you compare them head to head, cancer associated with both, excess weight, which leads to diabetes, which leads to heart disease, also you see heart disease with, with cigarettes, both bad for dental health and well-being. So again, we're talking about added excess sugar. It is a major problem in our society and in our diet. When you put it like that, it sounds so Sorry. much worse. <laughs> so exactly how much sugar are we getting? Okay, let's go through some numbers. First of all, the World Health Organization recommends no more than 25 grams a day for kids and women. If you're a man, that's 37 grams a day. That's about seven teaspoons of sugar. When you talk about the amount of sugar in one 20 ounce sugary beverage like a soda this is what it looks like Eva it's 15 <laughs> teaspoons that's more than twice what you should be getting in an entire day and it's not just soda it's juices sports drinks all kinds of stuff when you pour the sugar out it makes it much more dramatic pretty big impact so what do you do to cut down is there something you can do to substitute this is my tip for parents and for their kids number one do not put these drinks in sippy cups or bottles for babies and toddlers they should be drinking water and milk read the labels, get their sweet fix from real fruit. That's obviously fine. And listen, we have to lead by example. We have to talk the talk and walk the walk. I'm really glad the vending machine wasn't working this morning. I was Me about too. to have a Diet Coke this morning. <laughs> Didn't get to have one. All right, thanks, Dr. Ashton, for joining us. Adrian, no more sodas. You know what? I'm rethinking that chai tea and that hot chocolate. Thank you so much to you guys. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.